They weigh in at 5,000 pounds each. Huge planks of red oak are placed on top of a wetland near the Malala River. Contract workers from the Bonneville Power Administration use the heavy-duty boards to form a wooden mat over the wetland. The wood will cover and protect sensitive plants and soils during a BPA construction project. We do it to protect the environment. And the beauty of the mats are you will not damage root systems, you will not damage anything up below the, below the surface. The thickness and strength of the mat are what protect the wetland during construction. The wooden cover is so strong, it can even support a 240,000 pound crane. We're going to put a new tower up. We're going to move the, the lines from the old tower to the new tower. BPA workers need the large crane to replace a 130 foot high transmission tower located in the wetland. The structure that is part of a large 500 kilovolt transmission line is threatened by the encroaching river and in danger of toppling over. Like it? Using the heavy crane, crews install a replacement tower further away from the river than where the old structure is located. Hey, the new transmission tower is also stronger and designed to withstand the river's floodwaters. What we're doing is we've moved the structure to a new point uh, 50 feet back, roughly 50 feet back, and so we believe that that will buy us quite a bit more time. The river may never come up here. Workers say wetland mats make construction projects like this one easier. Without this mat, crews might have been forced to dig up and rock the wetland to support the heavy crane or use track machinery, damaging the sensitive environment and causing erosion. Mats also minimize the need for restoration, ensuring that any impacts to the wetland are temporary. So we will reseed this after we uh, remove the mats in a week and within uh, a month you would see it just like it is right now. And the reseeded vegetation is quickly growing back. Soon there will be no evidence of where the big crane once stood. And that's what I want to see. Um, and that's the direction that we've been moving in and it feels real good. Joseph Sharp, the manager of BPA's Pollution Prevention and Abatement Program, says BPA goes above and beyond what environmental laws require and the use of wetland mats is just one example. We can come up with win-wins that support you know, transmission reliability and some of the things that we're doing are actually reducing our overall costs while also protecting environmental resources.